Homeowners in a Hayes County neighborhood are continuing their fight to gain control of their homeowners association. They've already lost a court battle, but say they're still pushing to have a voice in how it operates. KXAN investigator Brian Collister found that battle affects everyone who owns a home and is required to pay HOA dues. And Robert, these Driftwood homeowners spent more than $240,000 suing their HOA because they say they have no vote in how it's run. Their neighborhood, La Ventana, has been bought and sold to five different developers over the years, and each development company has controlled the HOA board and who can serve on it. They come in, change the rules to benefit who? Benefit me? No. And in fact, lots of times what happens is it doesn't benefit me. It has the, exactly the opposite effect. And that's what's dangerous about this never-ending um, builder, developer, uh, declarancy issue that goes on till the end of time. We did reach out to the current developer of La Ventana, Paysetter Homes, but the company declined to comment. And tonight on KXA News at 10 o'clock, you uncover a loophole in state law that allows this very thing to happen. Right. What we found is that this is happening in a lot of communities across central Texas, and homeowners might not even know it. Thanks, Brian. Well, join us tonight as we continue our homeowner control investigation on KXAN News at 10.